There we go. All right. So um, it's 14 now. I think that is a good enough time for us to start. So has everybody gone to Kahoot.it? Nod your head. Morgan, I was going to ask, can you, what kind of uh, questions are going to be on here? Do you know? Oh, oh. Uh, well, Black queer questions. I mean, like pop culture stuff. Um, there's some stuff, you know, that involves Black queer Chicago um, also. Things that I, I believe Black queer people should know. Um, Alan, what, what would you say? I think that covers it. I know we got some folks from out of town, so there is a chunk of it that's uh, Chicago specific, but the majority of the 50 questions is about um, fictional characters, um, historical pieces, all that kind of stuff. So it should be fun. Well, I mean, we but even know if will be a learning experience. So. Yeah, exactly. but I, I would say this. I would <laughs> Edutainment. Say you said what? Edutainment. Yeah. <laughs> but even if you are from out of town, I would also say that I would also hope that you would know everything about Chicago because Chicago is the greatest city in the world. So, um, hey, what? I mean, that's that's just me being honest. Um, so facts. We are ready to start. Um, Alan, New York City would not like to enter the chat, child. <laughs> and we are up. All right, so y'all have about five seconds. So yeah, it's pretty self-explanatory, but basically whatever answer you think it is on the screen, tap that shape on your secondary device to choose that well, answer. Five people guessed correctly. Mm. Yeah, PB, Bahara, Benet. Uh, a couple of y'all was wrong talking about Shangela. And three people said it was Latrice for yeah. I'm so sorry, Candace, that didn't load for you. I'm assuming that's because you said New York City would like to enter the chat. <laughs> that's probably why it did that. All right, let's go to the next. <laughs> and see, you get a score afterwards. Of course, Allen would be in the lead, right? Hmm. And you got to type your answer this time. I'm calling it now. I'm gonna get like zero points. This is embarrassing. <laughs> no, this is good. You got this. That's gonna be something that you know. <laughs> wow. Only three people knew that Frank Ocean's first album was called Channel Orange. I totally knew that, but like I, I didn't know what I didn't read the question right. <laughs> okay. I understand. That happened to me sometimes. <laughs> All right, uh, hold on. Duante. Uh, can he still join the game since we started, Alan? Yes, it's not locked. Okay. Uh, so, Duante, you just joined. You have to go to Kahoot.it. I'll probably do it on my on your phone, like my phone right here. Um, go to Kahoot.it. You're going to type in that pin in the corner. Then you're going to type your name in. You're probably going to be three or four questions back. We're about to go to number four right now. So, let's go, Alan. Look at that, Alan, number one again. It's Dramedy with Logos' highest rated original series. It's Dramedy, Logos' highest rated original series. Hey, 10 of y'all know correctly. Two of y'all, I don't know, y'all just assume that Logo had the world operating correctly. What the L word should have been there. I don't know. I'm trying to make a patriarchy joke right there. Alan, think. you're on fire now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Look at Alan. Okay, now everybody should know this. Because y'all remember it won. Well, first they tried to act like it didn't win. 
And then they gave him the jacked up victory, but it was already like it was ridiculous how they did it. Thank you, Morgan, because I was about to type the wrong thing. See, we told Morgan she can't be talking. <laughs> I don't know who typed. Who typed? Hold on, hold on. Before we even go to the next one, who t- you about to clown somebody? I, I don't. I just want to add. I just want to add. I just want to know, like, who typed Philadelphia? Now, that was a, a good movie. Technically, it was an Oscar award. It movie. was. It was. But it wasn't black, was it? They had a black character, but I don't think. Yeah, yeah they had a black person in it, but it wasn't a black movie. Come on. And I don't know if it was black. But uh, key point, all the, the answers are about black queer people. in the Yes, because this is black queer trivia night. We're not just going to be black people around talking about other people. To be fair, it does, the question does say the first LGBTQ, and it doesn't it does. that. You are correct. I see. Yeah. But it's your best picture. Yeah. Yes, sir. Where about I a mountain? Ooh, we're going to press next. <laughs> this, this is about to tear us apart. Popular. <laughs> <laughs> popular TV host got his Oh wow, they they lying calling somebody popular. That was me being shady. Oh, everybody knew that about Caramo. All right, we're gonna move on. Next question. That's for me. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Janet Mock served as an editor for which popular magazine? Only one person knew it was people. Y'all thought it was Ebony? Come on, y'all. Y'all know they don't treat us right. <laughs> like, oh, like, you can answer these questions. <laughs> Oop, now Candace, not <laughs> I can't win, and I don't know all the answers. <laughs> <laughs> JL, baby, Alan Creative. You know it. Once upon a time. All right, y'all. This is, yeah, this is an interesting one, okay? Yes, Laverne Cox was a contestant on I Want to Work for Diddy. Not Everybody 30 and over. Not a long lasting contestant. <laughs> a contestant. They got representation slightly. All right, and then this person won RuPaul's Drag Race Season 8. Now, here goes the odd factoid for everybody. I have never watched RuPaul's Drag Race. Me either. I don't Me even think I'm qualified to be hosting this right now if I ain't watching it. I will I be revoking gay, I will be taking gay points away from folks as we go along. <laughs> oh, I know Bob the Drag Queen. And three other people did too. I know, unless I know them because I met him, but I, I mean, yeah, I met, I met him. I didn't know him. I don't know him. Um, obviously, we're not counting Allen's scores. Yeah, Allen, that's the question wrong. All right, y'all. Now, who started the famous AAADC dance company? Think about it. Oh, what's his? Oh, come on, y'all know this. Don't play. Do not play. I'm gonna call my mama right now if y'all don't you know this. Both words too. I'm gonna call my mama. It's just two words, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh. Up. Oh, wait, but that person almost had it. They just didn't know how to spell Alvin. No, I, I, I didn't. I really didn't. <laughs> <laughs> nine, people, nine people got it right. Look at y'all. I was about to raise my hand. I thought that was me. <laughs> True or false? Amaya Scott was the first trans woman ever cast on Real Housewives of Atlanta. All right. We need some more seconds for some of these questions. Nah, hey, y'all said it went too slow last time. Hey, hey no, we didn't. You're talking about pre show stuff now, all right? Brianna's on a hot street. <laughs> Before Empire, Justice Smollett starting this Patrick E. M. Pope film. It's not a subway commercial, you all. <laughs> you just gave the answer out now. 
That was too quick. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I, do, I thought it was just me. What is not? Come on, y'all. Black queer fictional characters. That's what the category is, y'all. Okay. Let's go. I'm about to learn something. I didn't know we had fictional characters. Oh, I know this one. Oh, sorry. Okay, y'all. I'm going to take a guess. I have never read nor seen the color purple, so I do not know. Somebody, somebody help her. Look at that. Other people didn't know either. Half of y'all Yay. Like me. I also have not seen her. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's heating up. President Obama comes to discussion. Huh? Oh, I know this. All right, y'all. Y'all should know this. I know I got this wrong. Oh, my God. What? Wait, no, who I got it right. That? Who that? Who's that? Who's that? Can, hey, someone, can, can someone break that last question down? But this is all from the wire. These are characters from the wire. Oh. I mean, now look, this this should have been. Unfortunately, I can't take your points away because I don't know how to go in and change points. <laughs> but I mean, I'm gonna be honest. With black people, y'all should know the wire. Like, um, I'm be. You can feel free to take a point or two from my purple. black card. Hold on, the wire. Right, I watched the color purple. Come on, the okay. wire is a dramatic TV. show. <laughs> I can't wire watch the wire. <laughs> The greatest TV show of all time, and and President Obama knew that, so y'all should know. President Obama don't know a lot of pop culture stuff. He's wrong a lot of times. When it comes to pop culture, he's wrong. Hey, for the educated guests. Yeah, Annalise Keaton, Keaton, come on, y'all. That was how to get away with murder. You got to watch your stories. You're going to play this game. You got to watch your J- story. <laughs> looks, like J- looks like J.L. about to win this money. Our modern day story. I have no idea what this question is talking about. Forget uh, the L word. Oops, I got that wrong. Y'all didn't watch the L word, child. Okay. I've never watched the L word. Is that a black show? That was a black quick character. <laughs> yeah, Pam Greer. She can make any shit. That mm-hmm. happen. You know, she was beyond behind bars. Now y'all know that this is a uh, Laverne Cox's character, right? We need more time because I'm I, I got that wrong just trying to hurry up and the answer. <laughs> All right. JL got it. JL in it. Gail and Candy are catching up. You at JL. I said Pearl. I actually read this book. I really oh, like this book. Jesus. It's the mom. I said Pearl too. Yeah. And I messed it up too. You messed <laughs> it up. Show. Look, How some of them it? in the chat, they're saying it's too fast. It's too I fast. I know I'm not the only one. Well, no, I'm going to say this. I'm going to say this, y'all. If it's moving too fast, that means that your mind probably moving too slow. Just hurry up. Oh, <laughs> are you calling us so stupid? <laughs> no, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> wow, wow, wow. <laughs> I just feel I just I just feel like you slapped the hell out of me just now. I did not, I did not. <laughs> Next question. Come on. After escaping the red center. Come on. Murdering a client. Oh, this from the handmade show, ain't it? Sure is. I shouldn't have. Oh, did I get this wrong? I love this show. Look at that. You getting it wrong and you done, you love the show. 
Come on. Yusha Bell. Yusha Bell is making her way up. You want that money. Oh, oh, shit. Play it. Too <laughs> fast that time. <laughs> <laughs> it went too fast. I that hurried day. up and just chose something and it was right. I can't believe it. Look at God. <laughs> she didn't. Okay. Okay. Hmm. That was from Orange is a New Black. Mm -hmm. It was. Meep Meep is the highest climber right now. Oh, I know this one. You watch Love Fam? Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> I saw it once. Oh, uh, 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 God is working in my favor. Come on, <laughs> Jesus. Look at him. He turned this into a multiple choice test. He just hit his feet. <laughs> <laughs> you ain't lying. Look, I don't even feel offended. That's exactly what just happened the last couple of questions. She lit up my mama's. Dang it. Okay, that's your mama's. Your mama was reading about Elin. She was reading Elin Harris. Hold on. You want me to wait? Uh, yeah. Hold on, real quick. Let me uh, in, let me explain. Yarima. Ooh. Hi, Yarima. Hi, Yarima. Um, so you just joined. I need you to grab your I need you to grab a second device if you have it, or hit a second screen on your laptop or device that you're using. You're gonna go to kahoot.it. Kahoot.it. And then you're gonna type in the game pin of 3945909. Now we like 20 questions in, but you still have a chance because the game is moving really fast. And for some reason, some of these people's hands or their minds are moving slow. So they cannot answer, you know, with the speed that the game is asking them. They <laughs> may still have a possibility of catching up. Uh, go ahead to the next question. <laughs> I have a whole section on sports, too. So, Oh, wow. This oh, gonna be I'm like going to fail questions. that one. I'm about to say, I know I'm not going to get that. Unless you talk about WWE. <laughs> and that is a sport. Chicago time. She's the first openly. Oh, wow. She wear a lot of big suits, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> she wear a lot of big suits. And you need her whole name. Big suits. I'm, pur I'm, I'm purposely putting Jamie's reference to her name. <laughs> big suits, y'all. Big suits. They got a lot of time to answer this one. Don't Alan, make sure you pull up my answer when, when this finishes. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> oh, gosh. Y'all can hear the music, right? Why you put that video there for her? Come on, put Auntie. <laughs> Auntie is right. Auntie is right. And Live foot. Live foot is right. right too. <laughs> Live foot should have been right. <laughs> They all still winning this. Wait, I put life on. <laughs> oh, I know this one. Is it the one on Jeffrey? I know it started with a J too. <laughs> so I hope that you did not give everybody a free pass on that one. I don't know. Let's see. Come on, Club Escape. My sister's room. <laughs> oh, I forgot the S. Oh my God. The S. <laughs> I tried to help y'all out. I tried. That's not right. That was <laughs> a free pass. This is Jeffrey's Pub. Y'all know it's on 71st. I didn't know that was the longest. Gay bar in Chicago. Yeah. Who is this? Oh, that's the name. 
Let me mute myself because I don't know who these people are. And I feel like I should know. Who is this? <laughs> I should know. <laughs> They're going to pull my card back. They're going to say, yo. I'm about to lose my job. <laughs> I'm going to lose my job. They're going to say, yo, you're not even, you're not coaching. <laughs> After Maybe this one, somebody coaching. break down the answer. <laughs> Sorry to this man. Pat Alan, you better not be the only one who got that right. You better explain to us who Pat McCombs is. Pat McCombs, McCombs is, was an activist uh, in Chicago um, back in the day. She's still alive and well and still fighting for uh, Black queer rights in Chicago. Cool. See, edutainment, y'all. Yes. And this she was, why, part, she was also it. part of Chicago's Black Lesbian and Gays, which was, uh, she was part of Affinity and uh, Adobe, and they came together and did Chicago Black Lesbians and Gays, and she was part of the organization that put together Chicago's first Black Gay Pride. That's what it was. I was trying what? to remember. And see, That's I appreciate that, Alan. Again, y'all do not worry about Alan's score. He is not competing. He is one of the Black Red Cross leaders, but he is not competing. I just learned something. But I appreciate that. I think she might also be in the Gay and Lesbian Hall of Fame. I think she is. Hmm. Lighthouse. Lighthouse? (laughs) Question (laughs) mark. I mean, the I'm picture so, gives it away. It ain't. I'm so it is. I'm scared. Just that out there for y'all. If this picture ain't the answer, then y'all are so bogus. The picture ain't the answer. <laughs> oh man! Wait. Oh. What is church okay. of the open door? Church of the yes. open door. Church of the open door is actually open longer than Lighthouse has. I forgot about that. No, where is yep. church? Of the open yeah, door? where are they at? Hold on. Get it's back. no longer it's no longer open, but it it was I know it was opened in like the '90s, so it has been yeah. it has a longer tender than the Lighthouse. Yes, there's a great article in the Tribune about uh, two black lesbian women. Uh, hey, Candace, the first black gay church. Candace said, "Church of the closed door." I was about to say this chat is lit. You, y'all are missing the jokes in the chat. <laughs> <laughs> the church no, church yeah, no I, walls, I don't man. like ugly. It's the church of no walls, man. That's what it is. Church of no walls. Because it don't so yeah. technically all of us that voted Lighthouse were right because Church of the Closed. Oh, never mind. That's never mind. I'm done. <laughs> yeah, it says longest lasting, That's not it. still open. Yeah. That's okay, why Hannah. Close? Somebody asked why did it close? I mean, it closed due to um, essentially fear of going to a black gay church in that in those times, because we're talking about in the 90s, because I actually went to church at the open door. Mm -hmm. And then also another reason is, is that they were gifted a church and the parishioners could not actually maintain the building. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. Do you remember what year it closed? Unfortunately, I do not. Well, thanks for that information. See, look at this. As you taming over here. Oh, guilty. Oh, oh, what happened, JL? JL said, y'all wrong for these Chicago questions. <laughs> I, I truly, wrong. truly disrespectful. <laughs> <laughs> no, hold on. Chicago is the greatest city in the world. So. <laughs> All right. Keep it going. Type your answer this time. Oh. Virgin and comedian. Oh, hmm. correspondent? Who y'all talking about? Wait. Oh, I know which boy you talking about. This could about. have been multiple choice. <laughs> <laughs> I know which boy you talking about. I know about. who you're talking about, but I can't remember. I can't name. remember. Even name name. Fortunately, I'm not playing with y'all. So y'all <laughs> enjoy writing this answer down. Wait, he from he from Chicago? From Chicago, yeah. went to DePaul. Oh, oh my God, is it? Yeah, Larry. Hey, go right there. Y'all couldn't remember his name. Jabuki. Jabuki. <laughs> Who? 
Let's go ahead to the next. Oh, we changing categories, y'all. What is Blazer Trail? Oh, these like trailblazers. Exactly. I get it. Okay, there we go. I had to switch <laughs> the words up. <laughs> Open the gay man and want a prime time in there. He's a 90s R&B fan. We need to delete these fill-in-the-blank answers. <laughs> oh, this was easy. Like, who was the 90s R&B singer? The picture is showing you, too. Oh. Who was that? Oh, Sasha, Sasha, I can't Sasha. think of his name, but I know oh, exactly who it is. The category is Billy Porter. The category is. Y'all, you should let Billy Bob. Come yeah. on. Uh-huh. Y'all I know keep spelling these names wrong. Uh-huh. I did one of his songs in college for a recital and didn't even know when I was watching Pose that that was him. Yeah. Probably because he dropped all that weight because back in the day he was a little bit chunkier than he was when he showed up on pause <laughs> and singing to, you know. All right, y'all. George is the highest climber. The category is continue. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Who got drafted by the NFL? It's an ah. easy one. Oh, yeah, he was a drafty. He just didn't make the team. He got his teeth fixed, though. Good for him. <laughs> Shady. <laughs> Shady tree. Oh, he got his teeth fixed? Ooh. Yeah, he got his teeth fixed. And his partner broke up with him. He was the first black gay male athlete. Male athlete. Yeah. And he's in the picture. Oh, shoot. Jason Collins. I guess that I'm looking that. after me. Yeah. <laughs> well, definitely. y'all, here goes a funny, here goes a cool fact about Jason Collins. If you combine him and his brother, his twin brother, Jerron Collins, you still would have gotten a below average NBA player. So. Oh, my God. <laughs> Morgan came out here to cause chaos. I'm here for it. <laughs> Morgan chose violence tonight. <laughs> That's what I was just about to say. <laughs> oh, y'all know this one. Come on. He used to have red hair. Morgan, I have to tell you, I know nothing about sports. He came out. I'm talking about this person right here. He came out. He used to have red. He came out. He it took the red hair for him to finally tell us what we already knew. It was a walk-in closet. I love this little animation that you guys are doing. Walk-in closet. <laughs> John Lemon, yes. Somebody said the red hair. <laughs> <laughs> It was a walk-in class. We got trivia and deaf comedy jam all in one. Come on now. A battle between Gil and Jail. Mm-hmm. But Candy ain't that far behind. Candy gonna catch up. Thank you, Morgan, because I don't act like I didn't exist. <laughs> <laughs> I waited when I saw your face now. <laughs> and you should bill coming through. I see it. I see it. JL making this comeback. Hmm. Who typed in Langston Hughes? I'm so glad that they don't tell you that. (laughs) (laughs) Langston Hughes. Same here. That man was wrote poems. I was not he one of the poems two. pretending he was straight. <laughs> Let me stop. Oh, I don't know who. I didn't know he went to DePaul. The DePaul in Chicago? Yep. Oh, oh this is the tall brother, right? Oh my God, I got this wrong. 
So I think Barry Jenkins directed it, no? Or? Yes, Barry, yes, Barry Jenkins directed it. Uh, I went to Jenkins too. Oh my god. Uh, yeah, I almost went to Jenkins, but Whew. yeah, Barry Jenkins was, it was a great movie, y'all remember. It was. Life life changing. Yeah. I went to hold on now before we go home. I went to see it at Arc Light Theater. Um, I want to say over there in Lincoln Park. And I was so frustrated because when the movie ended, you know how it ended with them laid up? Don't all of the spoil it. I haven't seen it yet. It's on my list. It's been, it been out for five years now. We're not <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> when it ended with them laid up, the white people did not clap when it ended. I was like, wait a minute. Y'all not going to sit here and tell me y'all wanted to see them. Like, <laughs> I said, child, if y'all don't get up and clap, <laughs> uh, clap for black queer love exactly that's uh, okay they clap for jennifer hudson and dream girls after she did you're gonna love me in every theater i went to go see it so hey i'm okay with that that don't count it's not and same. she got the oscar all right let's go to the next <laughs> he said that don't count <laughs> oh all right Hey, it is not Sister Soldier. <laughs> Damn. Oh, Eugene, because it ain't coming up for me. It is not Sister Soldier. It ain't coming up for you. I can't type the answer. It's not coming up for me. Are you Googling the answer right now, Candy? <laughs> I am not. Don't do that. <laughs> nah, I told you lead track for you long, but you didn't want to. <laughs> Googling the answer. Oh, it's not coming up for me. It's not coming up for me. That, that's why he put five seconds on each answer. So you don't have time to Google. Laundry yeah. Lord. You're called the laundry Lord. <laughs> okay. Let's go on. Let's go to the next one. Oh, my bad. Sister Soldier. Y'all know Cold is whenever uh, part two came out. What? Yeah, she just had a part two come out. The code just went up. I have to look for it. No, you don't. It wasn't that good. I'm saying you ain't got to like punish yourself like that. Well, I thought the book was good. I read the book in high school. I hope I'm not dating myself. Well, look at y'all. Y'all guessed this one because I had no idea who this was. I had no idea who Rihanna was talking about. Almost got me with Richie, but I was like, no. Yeah, yeah. I don't can, some, can somebody break this one down too? I would like to get yeah. my education. Alan, why did you, what, what is this? Is, a, is he in Palm Springs? Yeah, what city was he the first uh, mayor? What city was he the mayor of? I think it might be Palm Springs. It was I what? Mondaire and Richie are from New York, I'm pretty sure. Cause we gave them like shout outs on our social media. Wait, so he was from like a small New York city or something? No, I think he's from Palm Springs. Man, so what city was he the mayor of? It was it was Palm Springs. It was Palm Springs. Thank you. You know, Google. Oh, we can Palm use Google Springs. now. We know the answers. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Sometimes they, they, was little, they was a little progressive. Okay, I got it. <laughs> Who else we got? Hmm. Well, that could have been multiple choice then. <laughs> that is the one. I don't know the answer to this one. Y'all get the longer time. Y'all actually got enough time to Google question. on this one. Y'all got enough time. Y'all got more than enough time to Google on this one. That's Not if you got wow cable for your <laughs> internet provider. <laughs> oh. <laughs> How did you got wow cable? Oh my god, you got wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Somebody said Magic John. Somebody rude. I ain't know. Oh, Phil man. Wilson, y'all. Does that mean nobody answered? I knew it was Phil, but I was like, it's not Phil Jackson. <laughs> Wait a minute. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I want to know who put Magic John. <laughs> well, I ain't know. I ain't, I ain't it, know. It wasn't I really me. Didn't know. I'm I'm shaggy <laughs> on this one. It wasn't me. I put brown, so that wasn't me. You <laughs> got some y'all. I read, I ain't know. So I, and I left out an L. Hmm. I couldn't put EJ. <laughs> Ooh, ain't nobody got nothing on that one. Okay. Okay. What we got right here? Ooh. 
Uh, I, I just saw her the other day too. Yeah, this is oh. a girl in uh Minnesota, Minneapolis. Last no, it's not a Jenkins, black, y'all. Jenkins, is it? Andre oh Jenkins. my god, let's <laughs> try to get y'all astray. And she family, damn. Yeah, she got the same last name. <laughs> and she family, <laughs> no, she's gonna be at the family that, reunion. That's cousin. <laughs> All right, y'all, we got the last 10. Now, this is history. If you don't get this, you get some points taken away. Oh, hold up, because I went to click and it just went away. Yeah, that was exactly, that, that's oh. exactly what happened to me. Okay, okay. Now, this is rigged. All the rest hold of on, why did three of y'all write Pepper and LaBea? What, what was that about? Only six people got an answer. Half of us didn't even get to. That was too fast. Yeah. It's going to be this fast from here on out. We got to make you work for the money. <laughs> Look, just make sure we do a nice little pause in between each question. This okay. will be all right. Y'all can read. Y'all can read. Y'all can breathe. Okay. We're going to try to breathe. Right. <laughs> this is intense. Oh, this is not as fast. Oh, uh, like I said, y'all got enough time to Google here. Got enough time to go heat something up. <laughs> Take a few bites. That thing gonna be still cold. There ain't no, there ain't that much time. <laughs> All right, here we go. Who says Spice Girls? <laughs> Get Rima play with y'all. You nobody got Andre Leon Tab. Minute, no, because that E was on the E is accented. It's right just the, it. the spelling. That's rude. We need more multiple choice next time. Yeah, <laughs> it need needs to be all multiple choice. <laughs> I would have. My keyboard doesn't have that special E. All right, y'all. In 2014, she became the first transgender actress nominated for an Emmy. Didn't win, but was nominated. Y'all know her. We all know her. Miss Twirl herself. Twirl, twirl. <laughs> oh, I'm messing up the spelling of these names. You, you need to give me that one. I put G in there. Yes, I did, because I'm a G. Put, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, now she was born at the time, but it did spell Laverne with the G right there. <laughs> Damn, I follow her too, oh, man. All right, y'all, come on. Now y'all should know this one. The picture better match the answer. Okay, good. Okay, now hold on, hold on, hold on. Stop it. Stop I didn't it. have Stop enough it. time. Stop <laughs> it. Stop <laughs> it. No, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So, Lena Waite, right? It says she wanted him for her work on this comedy show. And it's since gone to write groundbreaking series like this shot. And boom. Now, if she won Emmy, for her work on this comedy show. And it's since gone on the right groundbreaking series like The Shy. How would The Shy be an answer? They all said all y'all answers be uh, Chicago anyway. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it was Master of None. It was a wonderful episode. I mean, I don't think that the rest of the show is amazing. It's actually a show centered around her coming out. Um, true story. So it's a beautiful episode. And it, and it won something. Um, JL Gill, it looked like y'all getting super close. Um, oh, dude, how quick was that? Five seconds. Who who hit Maxine Water? <laughs> 
Maxine Shaw, attorney at law. Hey. No, Maxine Waters. <laughs> oh, my bad. She's in the closet. <laughs> Not in the closet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. I actually met Maxine. I'm kidding. She is no, a Hannah very down to earth yeah. person. She Mike. is not in the closet, but okay. I just thought it would be funny to say that. Okay. Barbara Duran or uh, Maxine Waters? No, we know Maxine. Maxine Waters is actually from California. Gotcha. Yeah, we don't have no Cory Booker questions on here, so we don't have no people in the closet. Jesus. Look, everybody know. Okay, all right, I'm going to stop it. I would love for someone to break this down. I had no idea we had Black Quakers in our history. Oh. Okay, but y'all know who that person is, right? No. Nope. Y'all better know who that person <laughs> is. Find out. Now I'm let's so see how many of us it by right. Martin Luther King. That's gonna be the point. So, oh. so let's see. Let's see how many people spelled it right. That's the question. Uh, somebody put Uncle Luke. Y'all better quit playing with me. Oh, I got it right. <laughs> Somebody put Uncle Luke. <laughs> put Uncle Luke. Oh yes, yes, God. yes, Yarima. Yarima Bayard Rustin was the openly queer, he was a queer <laughs> black man who basically was one of the major arms and conduits to the civil rights movement. However, he could not be put out front because he was gay. Hmm. That's the same story as James Baldwin, too, right? Didn't he help Martin Luther King? You got a question about him, too? Uh-oh. That was too fast. God help me with that one. <laughs> it should have been paid me. All love for Sister Marshall. Mother Marshall. All right, now y'all should know this. Yes, I was about to say, if you don't know that face. Ooh. Make I saw that face. <laughs> Brother is distinct. Uh-oh, look at Pigman oh, coming wow. up. Oh, wow, somebody is getting yeah. moving their way up. Come on, we getting close to the end. And Pigman- Got two more come. questions. Oh, oh God. Yep. yep, come on, let's go. We got three more questions. Is this about the color purple? Morgan, I'll let her answer. Alice Walker, yeah, that is correct. Mm -hmm. okay, well, on. I just got booted out the game. <laughs> Can't get booted out the game. You oh, you also get points for how fast you answer too. Yeah, you just not here. Second to last Hold question. select, y'all. Oh, wait. Wait, so nobody got that one? Answered it. I did get that right. I don't know what happened. Yeah, I definitely answered that one. Yeah, I answered that one too. I don't know. Oh, the nah. devil. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this oh, is my anxiety. All right, y'all, this is the last question. Oh, God. Come on, y'all. Come on, if y'all don't know that. Psych. All right. Hold on, let's tally this up. Big man, number three. JL was number two, which means that JL won because Allen don't count. Woo! That's the spotlight and everything. <laughs> yeah, you got the spotlight. Hey, he can twirl, but he don't, he don't count. And thank you to Gil and Brianna for doing such a wonderful job. Right. So JL, you can either message us privately. Um, make sure you give us either like your cash app or your Venmo username. So we oh, can yeah, get you that prize. Um, so, did you all have a fun time today? This was yeah, awesome. Was Thank fun. you. Was fun. Yeah, so this fun. was dope and educational. Okay. Um, also, I would like to tell you all to go to Light Found Shy. 
Org, uh, because if you would like to know about updates with the Black Queer Caucus, we have a lot of other stuff coming up um, over the next few months. Also, we have Black Queer Pride coming up later this year, and we have a really important project um, that we are announcing April 15th. Um, that project is the Black Queer Equity Index. What that is, we are surveying organizations here in Chicago. And as we're surveying these uh, organizations, um, we are trying to actually pull data to discover what that Black queer equity looks like, you know, within their organization. So we done met with a executive director. Uh, we are surveying the board of directors, the employees. We're going to get these answers and then we're going to put them out to the public and hold these people accountable because at the end of the day, you got to actually hold these people accountable to create change. Um, thank you all for participating. Having a great time. Alan, uh, thank you for putting that game together. Uh, thank y'all for allowing me to, you know, make a few jokes tonight. Try to have some fun.